Williams, Lucas Graham at Isle of Wight Radio. Welcome to a very special Halloween-y version of uh, Headline or Hearsay. If you're watching on Facebook, you'll know what I mean. Uh, to be honest, I can't see a huge difference uh, with the two of you. No. But, uh, <laughs> to be honest, I'm struggling to breathe at the moment. Isn't it? <laughs> uh, just to say that uh, Hayley has a full face mask on. Yes. Uh, with a witch's, um, witch's wig. <laughs> Uh, that's the... my own hair. Oh, is it? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you got one. Of... Oh, a little bit awkward. Yeah, well, it was just a little bit awkward. You're gonna have to lift your flap up, Jamie. He can't hear you. I know. Uh, and Jamie. Yours? <laughs> Jamie has the most ridiculous mask on. Yeah, it's very warm under here. <laughs> yeah. Very warm. It. And, and just for those people that uh, uh, that are on Facebook, I'm going to show you the amazing set that's been built for this. <laughs> Quite incredible! Look at that. Wow. It, it's it's like a it's like a full haunted house <laughs> with bats and everything. Moon. I mean, to be fair, these theme parks are put on these themed Halloween events. Have I imagine they are concerned? They've <laughs> got nothing on us. <laughs> so, <laughs> right, anyway, it's time for Headline or Hearsay. We won yesterday, so uh, we are uh, winning. Uh, but it's all to play for today, as we know that this, this kind of has gone a bit wrong in the past. Let's get underway. It's Headline or Hearsay for Halloween. A bank clerk's performed emergency first aid after watching back-to-back -back episodes of a TV hospital drama. The woman from Colorado used domestic cotton and a sterilised sewing needle to close a bad wound sustained by her husband during a camping trip in a national park. Help wasn't for miles and with no phone signal she knew she act needed to act quickly. She'd seen the procedure on Grey's Anatomy and managed to stem the problem long enough to get her injured hubby some professional help. Headline or hearsay? Wow. I have to lift that up. <laughs> Jamie's given up with the mask. Oh! oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, headline or hearsay? Uh, I think that could be. I think that could be plausible. I, I I do too. I've heard this with casualty, certainly, that people have recognised that they're not well uh, after watching an episode <laughs> of Casualty. Uh, who have we got? Emma Elliott thinks it's a headline. Uh, Kirk says headline from Spooky Huddersfield. <laughs> Scariest place I've ever been to. Uh, David says headline. Michael says headline. James says boo. Uh, Brent says headline. Keith says headline. Haley says headline. Uh, Louise says headline this morning. Abby thinks it's a headline as well. Uh, oh, actually, Louise said hearsay. And Karen Eels thinks it's hearsay. Uh, James thinks it's both. <laughs> you can't do that. Uh, Corin thinks it's headline. So are we going headline or hearsay, Hayley? Headline. We're going to go what? Headline. <laughs> We're going to go headline this morning. Is it a headline or is it hearsay? We're going headline. Definitely headline. Yep, headline. It's a hearsay. <gasps> I can't take you seriously. I can't take you seriously. <laughs> that mask is scary. That has got me concerned. Hmm. Hear, my, hear my scary teeth <laughs> chatter. <laughs> anyway, uh, next one. <laughs> I told you, no expense has been spared on today's show. Oh, right, ready for the second one? There we go. <laughs> Royal Mail have banned deliveries to more than 100 residents on a street following health and safety fears over wonky paving slabs. Residents on the Victorian estate in Stoke-on-Trent are now forced to make a four-mile round trip to collect their letters and parcels from a central depot. Royal Mail postmen are refusing to deliver to the villas after it became a no-go zone due to a number of incidents involving colleagues falling and slipping. Headline or hearsay? You hear about these things, don't you? Yeah, I thought that was to do with dogs, with though. You're right, though, Jamie. Yeah. <laughs> Great. Luckily, you went for the one with the full face mask <laughs> and the kind of hat bit that goes at the back as well. It's looking good. They were a great idea. Yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, someone was saying on here that Hayley, did you forget to put your makeup on this morning? <laughs> yes, I did. 
Thank you. Uh, Kirk thinks it's headline, and so does Melissa as well. Michael thinks headline. Louise Flood says headline. Debbie Constable says hearsay. Julie Hollister says headline. Brent Croxford says headline. Emma Elliott says headline. Hayley Newby says headline. Hayley White says headline. David Harry says hearsay. <laughs> oh, very good. Uh, Lee says headline. Awesome masks. Thanks very much. Thank you. Steve says headline. Uh, Michael Fig says uh, nice lipstick. <laughs> that's, that's nice. Just should point out is is Michael your uh, fiance? He is my fiance. Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> uh, D says headline this morning. So are we going headline or hearsay? Headline. What do you think? Hmm. Lots of people are saying headline. Natalie says headline. Okay, we'll go headline. Headline. It is a headline. Yay! Nice. Pull it back, pull it back. Pull okay, it back. so it's all to play for on this one, is that right? It is, one all. 500 scary clowns, one London Burger King, free burgers. That was the marketing strategy for a takeaway food store in the capital at the weekend. Come as a clown, eat as a king was the killer offer as the brand embraced Halloween. Is that a headline or is it hearsay? That's a great idea. If it's Very not, good. it's not hearsay. If somebody here came up with that, they're in the wrong job. <laughs> <laughs> Dress like a clown, eat like a king. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, I know they did this with uh, pizza, didn't they? And it created miles of tailback traffic. Oh really? Yeah. Uh, David thinks it's hearsay. Elizabeth Hunt says hearsay. Marion uh, Warman says headline. Hayley Newby says headline. Corin says hearsay. Louise Flood says headline. Julie Hollister says hearsay. Uh, Keith Oxlade says hearsay. Debbie Constable says hearsay. Kirk Wilde says headline this morning. Uh, Bobbin Dixon uh, says clowns are evil. Yes. Uh, Emma Elliott says hearsay. Carly Morris says hearsay. Uh, Michael Hall says headline. Uh, Hayley Moore says hearsay. Hayley White says hearsay. And Lee says hearsay. Mm. It's split straight down the middle. What are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I think I'm losing consciousness very slowly <laughs> in this match. <laughs> are we going headline or hearsay for the win? I or, think it's going to be um, hearsay. What do you think? I think it could be headline. I do. I, I do like the strap clever. line, dress like a clown, eat like a king. Not to be a sport sport, but please hurry up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so hot in this mask. Mm, let's just decide on yeah, this. Yeah, let's have a think about this. Uh, <laughs> oh, dear. <clears throat> I think it's good. Let's go headline. <sighs> Well, I think it's headline. Let's go headline. Okay, let's go oh. headline. Is it headline? Are you sure? Or is it hearsay? I'm going, oh yeah, headline. It is a headline. Yay. Well done. I thought it was just too clever for somebody to have come <laughs> up with. So, uh, well done. Uh, thank you to everyone that's played along on uh, Facebook this morning. little blast of my organ for you to say thank you. <laughs> it's Isle of Wight Radio. It's 7.46. Headline or hearsay back. Same time, same place tomorrow. Thank you to all the people on Facebook and thank you to you at home for playing along too. Thanks, Facebook. Thank you. Goodness me. Wait for it. Oh! <laughs> Sheesh. Scary, oh, man. Look at his hair. <laughs> Dear me. Let's just keep this Facebook thing rolling for a little bit longer. Oh, goodness, I'm a bit hot now.